As the competition between businesses heat up, more and more businesses are pursuing faster read and write speeds for their data. However, the clustering architecture of relational databases is all one writer, many readers. How can we overcome this scaling bottleneck? Hello and welcome to another episode of Cloud Forward. Today, we will discuss how a cloud-native multi-primary architecture database conquers high concurrency. The clustering architecture of a relational database is typically one writer, many readers. In order to stay ahead of the competition, businesses are now pursuing faster write speeds in addition to data read speed requirements. However, many businesses have experienced scaling bottlenecks. Alibaba Cloud PolarDB's multi-primary feature introduces multiple primary nodes and read-only nodes to provide multi-writer and multi-reader capabilities. It's a nice-to-have solution for scenarios such as gaming, multi-tenant SaaS, and e-commerce. All data in a cluster is stored in Polar Store using the Polar File System, Polar FS, in a multi-primary architecture, allowing all nodes to share data files and avoid extra costs or latency for data copy. This is also referred to as One Data. Furthermore, by using the cluster endpoint, the database proxy allows you to access all nodes in a cluster. It automatically forwards SQL statements to the appropriate node, providing load balancing and make it easier to use and manage. Let's look at an example to better understand how it works. Assume you are running a SaaS company, where the number of tenant databases changes rapidly and the load volume fluctuates significantly. You must schedule database resources among different instances in order to provide the best possible experience. PolarDB comes in handy here. When using the PolarDB multi-primary feature, writes and reads are automatically routed to different nodes of tenants' databases. There's no need for any additional configuration. Furthermore, when adding more primary nodes, the write concurrency can be increased accordingly. It's similar to parallel write processing and linear scaling, which are both ideal architectures. And in a cluster, you can add up to 32 primary nodes. What a huge breakthrough! So, if you're looking for a relational database management system with the best write performance, check out multi-primary feature of PolarDB by clicking the link in the description below. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more Cloud Forward videos in the future. Until next time.